Hi, this is Peter Schiff at Euro Pacific Precious Metals. I wanted to do a special update on what's going on in the metals markets. You know, there's an old expression that nobody rings a bell when it's time to buy or sell, but in my experience, a lot of bells get rung. The problem is few investors are actually listening. Well, I think the world's central banks rung a pretty loud bell today to buy precious metals. You had the Federal Reserve, along with many central banks around the world, reduce their rates by 50 basis points that they charge for dollar swaps. In other words, it's now easier for the banks to borrow dollars. So we are increasing the quantity of global dollars in circulation. As a result, the dollar is losing value, and I believe it's going to lose a lot more value, not just against other fiat currencies, but against real money, gold, and silver. And so I think investors should be buying. Those of you who have been on the sidelines waiting for an opportunity to buy, I would not wait much longer. I would just buy. You have gold at around $1,700, silver around $32. I think these are good positions both to buy gold for the first time if you still haven't bought or to add to your positions if you already own. Also, don't overlook platinum. You know, platinum is trading at quite a discount to gold. I don't think that is going to last. You know, a lot of people think that what is going on is a bailout uh, for the Eurozone. It's not. It's a bailout for the banks on both sides of the Atlantic. You know, it's not a coincidence. Last night, uh, Standard & Poor's downgraded credit ratings for about 20 major banks, including banks like Bank of America, Morgan Stanley. You know, before the bell, Bank of America shares were under five bucks, a new 52-week low, and then this announcement came and the, sh the banks rallied. I think this is a bank bailout a la QE2. This is not about economic growth. It's about propping up uh, insolvent financial institutions by creating inflation. People who really understand this dynamic will be buying gold. And you know, it's not just the European central banks and the Fed. Look what happened in China. The Bank of China, uh, they reduced reserve requirements by 50 basis points. What's really significant here is for the last several years, they have been increasing those requirements to fight inflation, although they've been creating a lot of inflation to prop up the dollar with their foreign exchange policies. But now they reverse course. So now instead of tightening uh, in that respect, the Bank of China is now easing. Remember, the last move out of the ECB was also an ease when they cut their interest rates from one and a half to one and a quarter percent. The amazing thing is that the world is now easing when they barely tightened. I mean, that's how vulnerable uh, the global financial system is. They can't even stand normal low interest rates. They have to be super low to keep this whole house of cards from imploding. It's still going to implode, but the people who understand the dynamics, they're not buying dollars. They are buying gold. Now, gold and silver are up quite a bit today, but I think it's just getting started. I think as people have more time to digest what all this means, you're going to see more buying coming into the precious metals market. Even if you look at the mining stocks, which are up pretty big today, if you look at the PEs on these stocks, these are the lowest valuations in about 10 years. What that shows me is there's a lot of pessimism out there in the market. The professional investors still don't know what's going on. They still doubt this gold rally. That's not a bubble. That's a wall of worry that a bull market climbs. But I think a lot of people who have been questioning this market over the years are going to start believing in it. I think there's a lot of buying coming. And when that happens, I think prices are going to move up in a very rapid way. So the key is to buy before that happens. And remember, when you're buying gold, don't be scammed by the cons out there. Don't get ripped off by real bullion. Coins and bars, not collectibles, proof sets, numismatics, buy actual gold. In fact, before you buy any gold, take some time to visit my website, goldscams.com. Read my special report. It's free. It'll alert you to all the cons out there where people are getting ripped off by unscrupulous dealers who are separating their customers from their money. Read that. Uh, forewarned is forearmed. And if you want to make sure you don't get conned or ripped off, make sure you deal with Euro Pacific Precious Metals. Go to my website, Europac.net. If you're an existing customer of ours, great. You already know the drill. Uh, talk to your uh, metal specialist about adding to your account. If you've never worked with us, you know, go spend some time on the Europac uh, Metals website. 
give us a call, talk to one of the brokers there. Uh, they'll tell you uh, the, the products that we have available and make sure you get the most gold or silver for your money. Anyway, that's EuropacMetals.com. Thanks everybody for listening and remember the golden rule. He who has the gold makes the rules.